Hello everyone, I'm so happy to see you on my channel and in today's video we're gonna work on the eyes It's been a long time, we did not work on the eyes and I have not posted anything on the eyes So I decided to make this video for you because we want to look beautiful and nice during the winter holidays and we'll be working on uh, such problems as crow's feet and small wrinkles in this area and uh, general puffiness and it's going to be really deep massage technique which I recommend doing only two three times a week and alternate it with other massage techniques on the other days of the week so let's get started before we start working with our eyes let's heat up a little bit our ears on in order to make sure we don't have any puffiness after the deep drainage eye massage so first let's work on the ears and do quick finger massage for about three minutes Now we're starting to work with the eyes. We're placing our big thumb finger at the beginning of the eyebrow and we start gliding upwards till the middle of the eyebrow. We are smoothing it out and you may feel some unevenness and maybe even tension, but with practicing it will go really smooth and you will not feel any pain. We continue working on the eyebrow and now we are just grabbing the eyebrow at the beginning and we'll be rolling it to the side where our hair hairline starts if it feels really painful for you which can be uh, this means that there is extra fluid that we need to work on and get rid of and after three, four times of practicing this exercise on the regular basis. This will not be uh, longer painful for you, but it will be super relaxing and you will start really enjoying this exercise. Now we're again continuing to work on the eyebrow and we'll be rolling the skin but in a different technique. I'm placing fingers in a different position and I'm pinching a small amount of my eyebrow. I'm not pulling it down or pulling it upwards. I'm moving in a horizontal direction just as my eyebrow grows and I'm doing this from three to five times. And now we will work with our under eye area and the nose muscle in order to work on the tension in this area. Starting with the inner eye corner, start gliding sideways with short slides 
yes and trying to find the zone where you have most stiffness and tension or pain and try to really pay attention to that zone and work on it now again we are placing our finger to the inner corner of the eye and we are sliding downwards from three to five times or even more With the next exercise we're gonna work out on the puffiness and we'll be pinching the muscle which is located right on the bone we are not taking the thin tissue under our eyes but we are finding and grabbing the muscle which is located right on our bone and we're pinching it massaging it and moving downwards we're sliding rolling downwards repeat this for three to five times or even more up to 10 times is okay and this exercise works on the extra fluid on our face and makes our eyes look really fresh and well rested and has the impact overall on our overall face complexion And now just roll everything down to the collarbone and repeat all the exercises on the opposite side of your face. Completely same exercises as we have just done.
thank you so much for watching this video and i hope to see you in 2023 i'm wishing merry christmas and happy new year to all of my subscribers and people watching videos on my channel thank you so much for following me and being active and interactive and your feedback is so important and especially when i hear that something worked for you helped you i feel so happy at those moments and i also invite you to my social media channel instagram where i post information not only on products vitamins and uh, massages but also on physical exercises uh, simple e physical exercises that i use every day to um, impact in a positive way and impact my lymphatic system and i recommend you to follow them they're really simple but they are super effective and are a big game changer if you have any questions you can leave them down below and don't forget to hit the like button and if you're not yet subscribed please subscribe to my channel and i hope to see you again on my channel and in 2023 thank you again and bye see you soon and with my last message, I want to address uh, questions from ladies in their 70s and 60s and 90s who are asking me if those massages will work for them and if they should try them. Of course, of course, you need to continue taking care about yourself and doing the massages and they will work for you. The skin will start reacting to the manipulations that you do on your face the the face will start reacting and you will see huge improvement this will not stop aging and we are all accepting this like as a thing as as part of our life as a natural process it's okay but we should not we should not restrict ourselves from being pretty and liking our reflection in the mirror and there are so many ways how we can improve the way we look and feel and how much energy we have no matter what age we are still so, so please continue taking care about yourself and loving yourself this is my main wish for you in 2023 to all of my subscribers and to all of mothers and grandmothers please continue taking care about yourselves this will be a game changer if you do it on a consistent basis regularly and you keep to your drinking water regime and you have enough sleep and you are staying active and you do exercises aimed at your lymphatic system which you can find uh, also on my channel and in my instagram on my instagram page which are completely free and you can try them try them and then let me know and once you see that this worked for you please let your friends let your friends let your friends know about this techniques and what work for you to make them happier and more content with themselves and how they look yes let's share the knowledge okay so thank you so much again to all of my subscribers and don't forget to hit the like button and leave your comments if you have any i'm so sorry for being so long boring but this was my message this was my message never stop loving and taking care of yourself